Hello and welcome my friends, my name is Daily Fix and yes, we are continuing with the uh, the army end. We we got ourselves the battleship. Let's um, move you and actually move you closer so we can actually have a look at things. So here we go and they are the double, definitely double. Double the damage and not even double the price. So cost efficiently, the battleship would be the better option right now. And we are going for it. We are. So right now, let us merge these all together. And let's boost. Let us boost this like crazy. We'll uh, destroy two at a time and try to build this up. Like this and just um, upgrade, man. Upgrade. Let's make this fleet great again. And immensely, immensely powerful. Uh, preferably before next year. Because next year, uh, this truce will come to an end. And we are going to help out our brethren over here who are struggling. By the looks of things. And uh, with their uh, armies over there, I think it would be best that we make sure... We get a lot more armies going. So, five agricultural world armies recruit one, two, three, four, five. And we'll just uh, use the fleet man. Army logistian. Oh, that's cool. What expired again? Capacity overload, I'd say. What would be. Yeah, I would probably go for capacity overload. It's a shame. I don't need to. But the fleet currently is in a place where it is not costing me anything. At least, I don't think so. Oh yeah, we need to break some deals here. Break research deal, man. And who else do we have them with? With, um, with you. Can we actually take a look here? Let's see, status. Oh yeah, we got some research deals with you, which we're going to be breaking. I don't need you, you are way too tiny at the moment. And the Enlightened Kingdom. Yeah, I don't, I don't care, let's break that research deal as well. And... Yeah, that, that will spring up truces, which is uh, somewhat annoying. We have a defensive pack as well as some other deals. and. Yeah, I don't. I only want to have this guy, currently. So let's break research and break defensive. They were already. Um, this empire view is friendly. Ah uh, no, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. You you are not going to be friendly. Pro trust me, <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to tell you a new one. Yes, and this will give us more influence. No. As for you. Acceptance is negative 22. Um, all do all in good time, I would say. So let's take a quick look if we manage to break everything. Except for the hive. We will keep that. A non-aggression pack with them as well because they are quite strong. They are still superior. Yeah, that's it. So we should be making uh, four or five. Oh, five, yes. Oh, five is nice. Five... Five means explore. It's, uh, it's expansion. Definitely expansion. Can we go to this war? I need to go in there. They are both overwhelming. They just don't fight. But if they do fight. And we uh, manage to get that fleet up and uh, killed. Then that would be quite nice. So that ship is still building. How long until we get another unity point? And there we go. This is the starbase upgrade cost. Negative 33. Very cool, Technology very nice. I do want to have that. And here we go, the fleet logistian. Although curator. Hmm, maybe. Upgrade for food. No, let's go for naval cap right now. And let us ex actually make sure that we have naval logistian, logistics, naval logistics, and naval logistics. On all of our bases, yes. 
And once we get that perk in six months, we're going to be upgrading this one first. Because from this point, we shall invade. And we have to upgrade you as well. Actually, that is still working. You. Upgrade. Those are not too expensive. So I'm actually okay by upgrading them right now. There's actually an ideological side in there. I did not know that. Oh, we're exploring in this direction. Cool. That's a good thing that we have so many open borders. You're still assisting research. Yes, you are. That's gorgeous. So with all of this done, let's close that off. And let's make sure these guys are getting merged up. Because we need about 800 to get this planet. I want to get this planet under control and just use a few ships or a very, very small fleet to take all of this. And then those devouring swarms are not interesting. So we got the Keepers of Knowledge. And also, oh, there we go. Uh, gateway Travel, which is absolutely cool. Um, let's get the research alternative because it is cheap. But we got enough credits. So what are... Let's get all of these out of the way. The Artisan Troops. Yes. I would like to commission, let's see, one, two, three, four, wait, what, that's it? Oh, come on, man. Let's see, what will this do? Uh, monthly unity and opinion, why not? So, I want to invest in the miniature of culture. Unity from jobs. Yeah, sure, why not? These guys love me, you know. Um, let us make sure we get the art building. On some of these planets, which actually have a negative indemnities. Like you. Not you. Yet. And you, can I still build more? I can. I, I, I will build as many as I can. Because these buildings are absolutely great. Let's removing, I don't want to remove that. You. Exhibit. Are we building it on your area? Yes we are, and we're building it over there. And we have it all on you. So, I think but with that, we have that building on all of our planets quite soon. Which is great. Really is great. Also, we need a planet for the arts. I'm not sure if it is... Oh, there you go. Minister of Culture. It would be quite nice on this planet. So, coordinators turn energy into admin cap. And that's actually not bad at all. Yeah, let's build that. As for you, let's get the 33% reduction in our star bases. And what I said was you are going to be first. And that's 838, which is a drastic, drastic reduction, which I absolutely love. Let's upgrade you. That is not what I wanted to press. Thank you very much. Upgrade you. Are there more border stations? Well, you are going to be... No, we'll just do not too many and a go. Let's take a look at our fleet. Are you done? It did that ship finish? No, it didn't. Okay, let's uh, reset all of this. Because it is actually quite annoying to see. Let's close the planets off. And shipyards. There we go, 70%, and I think we can go to war. Yes, we are able to declare war. He is currently actually already at war with these fellas as well. So he is going to be having a bit of a problem. He just doesn't, doesn't know it yet. So... Are we going to wait here for the amount of time? Actually, I do. 
I do hangar base and get mm, communication jammer is quite nice battle stimulant actually that is what I also need can I have upgrades for all of my shipyards now and get the battle stimulant in there of simulant or whatever and let's merge you up are we still building armies we are currently building one more army then we start moving them out it is time the amount of troops and we need them oh boy we do need them uh, because they are defended by 900 to Valhalla yes to Valhalla indeed so that's all upgrading the fleet is currently waiting for oh no the ship is done I'd say is it it is done 21k so changing to battleships is starting to be quite quite nice hmm. but do I want to do that right now or wait until some of my ships get destroyed yes i set up a timer <laughs> so uh, for some some people that don't know this uh, empire that's uh that's the one although kind of hoped it was not visible but i'll uh, i'll check that later and turn that off diplomatic insult oh no you didn't oh he's insulting me oh he's so cute Go away, dude. Get back when you're serious. Argelus ex excavated a hunting lodge and stumbled upon several reference to the legendary Rexax, warrior known as the Huntress. She was apparently the most efficient killer, renowned throughout the domain for having personal personally butchered thousands of aliens. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, yes. There you go. Let's get those groups merged up. Wait for destroyed ships. I, I, I agree. I truly, truly agree. So, let's head over there. I wish that we would get newer battle computers. That would be quite nice. But we haven't got them yet. Oh, wait. We can actually become even stronger. Although, sublight speed for these battleships aren't that good, that bad. Because the cruisers, they are faster by definition. If I change these to... Auxiliary fire control. Chances to hit does increase. Um, the speed, however, is is something of a... Yeah, I, I would like to cry about the ship's speed. So, uh, let's not change that. Uh, when you two are ready and you're now in end home. So, and the one is in Popma. So, that's over there. And we do want to upgrade all of our stations Technology to Fortress. And the Citadel has there as well. Oh, the Mega! The Mega Cannon! Shield and Hull! And we use the ships for the uh, for the other one. Damn! Damn, that's nice. Let's get that. Technology Let's get question. Um, Blue ships as a carrier isn't that good. Is it for roleplay? Actually, I don't know, man. And uh, They are double double the, str the strength for less than half the cost and that would be cost efficient research speed let's take a research speed if we're at 1k we barely made 1k in a hundred years damn <laughs> oh boy so yeah we'll continue along there let's get the transports up over there as well though they can be a bit late and I would like to get... Ooh, the planet's under control. Let's see. We got one pop. We got a crap ton of housing. And we're going to be building this one up completely. So we don't have to worry about this. Uh, we still have some districts. Uh, let's get some food going. And more food going. There we go. Don't have to worry about that for a long, long time. Let's get rid of those. Without asking for your mid maxing, mid maxing, what the hell is a, a mid or min maxing? 
No, actually, uh, oh no, okay, expert, that's not, I, I was so worried he died. Which would be quite, quite annoying. So let's wait until our fleets are in position, and if we are able to, I would like to get in, oh wow, there we go. Oh wow, here we go, here we can actually see the numbers. It's 16, there's another one, like 17, right? Did I, I, I did spot a 17k. Yes, I did. There is a 17, a 16... Oof. Oof. You are overwhelming. Are you still fighting this war? How about you? You're also fighting this war. Ah. Ah, oh, that's, that's quite dangerous. That is quite dangerous. You only have one fleet. That's also usually not something I would go for. We do have... Oh, well, okay, that changes everything. Is that war goal? Humiliate? Sure. Fine, have it your way, dude. Um, number one. That station, they, they will go for this one, because this is through someone else's territory. Where's my... Why is my fleet no longer on one? There you go, one. One go here. Transports. Go here as well. Okay, that's fine. That solves a lot of issues. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm Technology going to tell you a new one. Let's see, naval cap plus 30. Naval cap from uh, soldier jobs or habitability. Let's go with habitability. And it's going to take a bit of a long time before I get there. Will my upgrade be done before their fleets get in here? I do not know. I do not know. I wonder what will happen to these guys. Since we did take this territory away, even though they were overwhelming already. Can we... Um, did we close borders? We cannot close borders. Oh well. It's fine. What could possibly go wrong? Beside me having to send all of my fleets the other way around and to, towards this end. And now of course not having the option to make these claims. Since we are currently at war. So let's get rid of them. And let's get a few more here on food. How particular. Was that with us? No. No. Our construction is complete. Oh wait a minute, look at this. We still had a district to go. Let's get uh, the anti-crime. And there's another one. You. Wow, really? Did I miss so many governors? Yeah, it's, it's okay not having all that much governors, but still. I wanted them. And let's get... Scholar, whatever. There you go. Actually... Yes, you are a scholar, that's great. Seven jobs available still. And there is a uh, resolution that had failed. Really, did not look at that at all. So, uh, minor military sanctions. I will oppose this. I don't need military sanctions. And we all know that this will eventually come and bite me. So, that would be quite annoying. Hmm, so far no fleets though. Are you not attacking? Hmm, yeah, things will be fine, I guess. This bastion is now done. Let's get hangers. And let's get the communication jammer. How long? 353 days. And my armies, they, they will be here a lot sooner. And we'll, uh, we'll see if we can actually make you a vassal. That would be interesting, at least for me. Senate is in recess about this one. Sure, why not? Bit of Empire Sprawl, but this is almost nothing, so let's not be worried about it. While we build up on alloys, uh, first things first, we need to make sure that our planet actually have enough population. Otherwise, it just keeps going the same way. So, we were declared war upon. 
which is fine. Our fleets are almost there. And we go ahead, going to have some fun here. So this is the only one that actually is quite uh, quite large, a station. Their homeworld. Yes, I would like that. Uh, well, we, unfortunately, because we did not have claims, we cannot take any of their systems. I hate that. I really, really don't like that option at all. But oh well, it is what it is. Uh, we apologize. We uh, sadly reached... Uh, reach something of a creative roadblock. Uh, we'll uh, take the opinion, whatever. So, here we go. You should almost flip over and look at this. They almost got it completely. Apart from this sector. Uh, th this does mean that we will have to go to war with them. Some more. Because they are still quite a danger. To deal with. Okay. What is this? The habitability plus 5? Lead a lifespan? Clone army? War gene? No, actually, let's go to leader lifespan because I hate it when my leaders die. And yes, I will leave you at a cliffhanger because at the next episode, for if you're watching this on YouTube, um, we will have the war next episode, guys. If you're watching this on Twitch, then stick around and we will have uh, a go at this. Yeah, good to know. Go away. I don't know if someone has turned them on us or not. Anyways, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, hope to see you next time, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and have a good one, bye bye.